So Laura, this uh, today marks 100 days to go until the start of the London Olympic Games. Um, now obviously a lot of tennis players are saying it's one of their main aims and they'd really love to compete at the Olympics. But it's not as easy as that. It's going to be very tricky to actually make the team, isn't it? So can you just tell us a bit about what you're going to have to do in order to, to be playing at the Olympics if you want to? Uh, yeah, it's going to be really tough to get into it. Um, for sure, I'm definitely going to have a good... Uh, definitely going to have to have a good clear court season uh, to even have a chance of getting in. Um, but it's something that I would really, really love to be a part of, and so I'm going to work as hard as I can to make it happen. And just in general, do you think you'll be around when the Olympics is on and sort of getting into the spirit of things? Um, I hope so. Um, I think if I'm not playing, then I'll probably be playing the other tournaments in America. But my mum um, has tickets for swimming, hockey. And basketball um, so if I am at home I would love to go watch some stuff. Uh, and what sports uh, besides tennis would interest you at the Olympic Games and just clarify oh. darts is not an Olympic sport? No but I do like darts. Um, <laughs> I like I love handball um, okay. that's always really good to watch and I like rowing, cycling you know generally a lot of sports which I wouldn't usually watch but for some reason during the Olympics I'm glued to the TV um, and any sort of track and field, gymnastics, yeah, virtually everything. Is there anyone in particular that you're looking forward to seeing or that you'd really like to meet? Um, well actually after the last Olympics I met Michael Phelps um, and I mean I was so starstruck uh, literally like a week after Beijing so yeah that was amazing. Um, I would love to meet Bolt, he seems like a really really cool guy. And uh, and someone who lives in London, uh, what do you think of uh, what it's going to do to the city? It's going to it's going to be pretty exciting, isn't it? It's going to be very very busy. Yeah, um, <laughs> we've already had about five hundred people asking to stay at my house, um, and my sister's going to come over from Australia for the summer, so we're all really looking forward to having her back. But um, yeah, just in general, I think it's going to be such a great atmosphere in the city, and. I would advise people not to go on the tube at that time, it will be packed.